I believe that you are, and always will be, my little princess. You'll be going to the same school your mother went to when she was your age. Girls, say hello to our new arrival, Miss Sarah Crew. Hello, Sarah. Goodbye, princess. The New York Times calls it joyous, irresistible, bright, and beautiful. Waiting outside for her was the handsome stable boy, Pierre. The arrows sped through the air. A group of mermaids appeared. Stop. From now on, there will be no more make-believe at this school. A Little Princess is the story of courage tested. I hope when you read this, it kindles your heart and puts a smile on your face. Gene Siskel says adults will enjoy the story as much as their children. I'm afraid I have some bad news, Sarah. In the face of adversity. You are alone in the world. You will move to the attic from now on. You must earn your room and board here. You're not a princess any longer. A child must find the strength to persevere. Sarah will be working here as a servant from now on. There will be no communication exchanged. Is that clear? Now she will discover compassion through uncommon friendship. Let's make a promise right now to always look out for each other. It's a promise. And distant love. Papa, can you hear me? Magic has to be believed. That's the only way it's real. I am a princess. <gasps> All girls are. Didn't your father ever tell you that? Even if they aren't pretty or smart, they're still princesses. Good Morning America's Joel Siegel proclaims the movie is magic, stunningly beautiful. It's like stepping into a fantasy. It's a cruel, nasty world out there. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. But I don't believe in it. From the author of The Secret Garden comes the powerful story of a spirit that would never surrender. A Little Princess.